Hello everyone and how is it going? On today's video we're going to learn how to translate strings available in WP Travel. WP Travel plugin is a translation ready plugin in which you can translate the strings available in the WP Travel plugin in any language. For the translation, you can use the local translation plugin which will translate the strings available in WP Travel plugin. For the translation process, please follow the step by step guide. For translation, you need to download and install the local translate plugin from the WordPress plugin dashboard. Just head over to plugins and add new plugin. And here from the search plugins bar, search in local translate. After typing in local translate, you can see the local translate plugin is available on the very first number click on install now and with a fraction of seconds it will be installed additionally you can also download the local translate plugin from the link given in the description below just head over to the link and type in local translate and you can see the local translate is available in here too you can upload the zip file on this upload plugin option and you will be good to go after installing and activating the local translate plugin you will be able to see the local translate tab is available in the dashboard and here you would be able to see all of your installed plugins from the list look up for w travel or w travel pro after choosing w travel plugin you need to choose a language so please choose your language through new language and you will see some fields just pop up here you can see an option to choose a language you can select the language which you want to translate from here and make sure from the other section first option is selected to start translating click on the start translating button note i have chosen the nepali language after clicking the start translating button translation section will open where you need to search the string which need to be translated to search a string what you need to do is simply head over to this filter translation search bar and type in your string like for example i'm going to type in here activities so here you can see a bunch of results are showing up so currently you can see no source text is loaded so when you click on activities source text is loaded and here below you can see nepali translation where you need to paste the string translated version so I'm going to paste in the Nepali translation and simply save my changes. Now we are good to go for the next step. What you need to do is just head over to settings and from there to general. Here from the site language you have to select Nepalese and save your changes. What this will be doing is that it will translate your entire site language to Nepalese which will allow the Nepalese language to display on our front end page. Now let's just head over to the front end page and see how is it looking. Here you can see the activities title is translated into Nepalese which was previously in English. Let's just translate few more to clear up the point. I'm going to translate trip type and group size to Nepalese. To translate simply head back to the local translate plugin and from this search trip types select the string and paste in here the related translation and save your changes similarly do it for the group size select the string and paste in related translation again okay so now we're pretty much done let's just head over to the front end page and see how is it looking so here in the front end page as you can see the trip type and the group size is translated into nepalese respectively it's a really simple process and i hope you understood that so yeah guys that pretty much wraps it up for this video and i hope you learned something new if you did so make sure to subscribe to the channel share with your friends and like this video until next time peace